What is up team? Welcome back to the work method and welcome to day four of the Titan program. We got a leg workout on the books for today. Let's hop into our warm up and jump into that first circuit. We got a three minute AMRAP warm up of five toe touches, five leg swings forward and backwards and 10 Kozak squats. So we're gonna start off. Uh, toe touch squats, we got legs straight. We're gonna reach down, grab the front of our toes, drop our butt, elbows inside of the knees, stand up. Then from there, we're gonna grab onto something. We're gonna do 10 leg swings forward and backwards. Right leg, same thing, left leg. Then we're going 10 Kozak squats. So feet wide, toes pointed out. Over to one side, back up to center. Over to the other side, five each side, guys. Three minutes on the clock. We're gonna cycle through that as many rounds as we can at a nice, easy pace. Just trying to get those legs and hips back warmed up. Three, one, and work. Toe touch squats, five reps. Pause in the bottom for a second. Try to open up those hips. If he never heard of Ben Dope, he just snapping. Jackson's off the rapping. Keep and then it on my body, bitch, I'm broke if you ask it. Don't got a silly, most of y'all is flawless. Broke your whistles, long as it is foreign. Heard you want it because the game's enormous. What's in, since she isn't gorgeous. Live my life, last name of Morgan Freeman. Trying to touch a forest. Do not know we're knocking on the door. It's came in, I came in, I came in. Did it like the Porsche is coming in. Yeah. And close that squat. I just want to win. Yeah. L.A. B.B. who we running with. I'm on 10 again. Okay, all right. Coming in. Yeah. Flex. I just want to win. Yeah. LA BB, who we running with. Yeah. Two, two, three, three. I'm on 10, 10, 10. Yeah. And then we go back to toe touch squats once you're done. Damn, man. <laughs> Try to feel the stretch and that adductor as you go over. up we got dumbbell reverse lunges and dumbbell squats low on the reverse lunges our rep range target is eight reps for every rep target for today is eight reps for our low dumbbell squats it's 10 reps so we're going to take two dumbbells start at the front of your mat chest up we're gonna lunge back let that knee kiss the ground drive back up eight on the right leg we got 60 seconds completed then we're going eight on the left leg with a 25 second rest between legs. Then we are grabbing two dumbbells and we're doing low dumbbell squats, meaning the hands are low at your side for 10 reps. So you're gonna go here, your feet are pretty narrow, a little narrower. We're gonna bend the knees and drop. Try to keep the chest up and don't turn it into a deadlift. So we don't wanna let it over too much of the chest. We're trying to bend at the knees and let those dumbbells come back towards your heels is the kind of goal. 
We have mild max sets on the second set of both of those. Same thing, we're gonna do mild max on the third set of reverse lunges, but we're gonna do a drop set on the squats. So in that final set of squats, you're gonna hit your max or 10 reps, drop the weight to a lighter weight and burn out. Any questions, team? Are we good? Hold on, I'm just gonna grab my straps real quick. On my lunges, I'm gonna go with 55's the start. This is week one, so we're trying to set the bar for the following weeks. Don't go crazy heavy that it's too, too challenging, but also don't make it easy. And you can increase weight on the second or third set here if you feel like you're undershot. I'm gonna go 60s actually. Let's go. We're going in four, three, two, one, and work guys. Eight reps each leg. Start at the front of your mat. Going back, let that knee kiss drive. second rest. Two. Rest team, 25. And then we'll go left leg, same thing, eight reps. I'm gonna go 60s on my low dumbbell squats as well. We're going in 10 seconds. Start setting up. Eight lunges on the left leg. Two. And work. Nice and slow touch. Seconds. Then we got a 25 second rest. We're going into low dumbbell squat. So try to keep that chest up. I'm trying to think about bending at the knees and letting the dumbbells come back towards my heels, not out in front of me. I'm going with 60s in each hand in 20 seconds. Try to keep your heels on the ground and push through that mid foot. Start strapping up, 10 seconds team. Come on. Three, two, one, and work. Ten reps. Slow on the way down. weight on both of those movements before the second set. Remember, these are mile max sets on this set. So, 
What that means is that we want to match the same reps you got as the first set, which is 10 or eight. Eight on the lunges, 10 on the squats. But you can take little breaks to get there. I'm gonna go up to 65 on the reverse lunge. I'm gonna stay at 60 on the squat. Lunge felt okay, squat felt heavy, squat felt heavy. 25 seconds, team. Walk it off in the meantime. Come on. Straps become incredibly useful here. It's hard to hold on to heavy weights for a long time. Those grip muscles are small, those leg muscles are big. You'll miss out on some leg gains. In three, two, one. Let's do it. Eight reverse lunges. Nice and slow, let that knee kiss, drive through the front leg. seconds and then we got a 25 second rest. A little extra rest on these don't hurt with the eight reps. Three. 25 seconds team walk it off. Try to clear some of the lactic acid from those legs. Recover a bit. Ten. Three, two, one, and work. Come on, left leg, same deal. Seconds to finish, guys. Two. 25 seconds. We got our low dumbbell squat for 10. And then we get into our final round. Eight. Three, two, one. Let's do it. 10 squats. seconds team. Two. All right, we got reverse lunges, our final set. I'm going up to 70s. 65 still felt. Eh. I want to set myself on the right trajectory for the program. If I start too easy or too hard, 
kind of messes up all that. I don't necessarily want to get the 70s, but I know I should. Here's our last set. These lunges are a straight set. You can take a little breaks if you need to. On the eight, on the low dumbbell squats, we're doing a drop set though. So have a light weight ready. I'm gonna go from 60s to 40s on that. All right, team, we're going reverse lunges on the right leg. In five, three, one, let's work. Come on, strapping up, picking up. Let that knee kiss the ground, slow, touch, drive. Twenty seconds. We got a twenty five second rest coming up. Twenty. Eight seconds, team. Two. Left leg for eight, come on. Eight reps, team. 10 seconds. We got a 25 second rest. We got low dumbbell squats coming up in 20. Come on. Three, two, let's work guys, come on. <clears throat> Drop set here though. Hit your max or 10, whatever comes first, and then drop to a lighter weight. Fourth column, 
is for your drop set. Weight and reps. All right, team. We got step downs and hip thrusts next. So you're gonna need a bench, box, something to step up onto or step down from, and then do hip thrusts from. You can use a couch, bench, box. So, we're going step downs. Eight reps is the target. A step down is you're up on the edge of your bench or box. A couple ways to do this, you can come down to the tippy toe or heel. Toe is easier, heel is harder. You're gonna try to come down nice and slow, touch, and then push back off. You do not wanna jump off the bottom foot. So you don't wanna come all the way down and then rest weight on this leg and then drive back up. You're coming down slow, touching, and then pushing back. And you can hold a dumbbell here. If you guys don't have anything to step down on, you can do split squats, although we did them earlier in the week. So there'll be some repeating, or you can do step ups instead. Different concept though. So we're gonna go eight on the right leg, eight on the left leg, no drop sets. Those are just mile max sets. Then we go into hip thrust. So you're gonna set up on a bench or box, dumbbell on your thigh. We're going for 15 reps here. We do have a drop set on the third set. So we're gonna get our mid back on the bench, dumbbell on the upper thigh, we're gonna go down nice and low, pause, squeeze glutes at the top, let your whole body pivot, keep your chin down, squeeze. You wanna feel this in the glutes and the hamstrings. 15 reps there, guys, so higher rep range. Eight reps on the step down, 15 on the hip thrust. Questions, are we good? Let's see. I'm gonna go 20, I'm gonna go 30 on the step down and I'm gonna go with 65 on the hip thrust. We're going in three, two, one, and work team. We'll go right leg first. I'm gonna hold it up here, goblet style. Nice and slow down, touch, try. The higher the box, the harder it is. You can also put the dumbbells up on the shoulder, whatever's more comfortable. Eight reps. Or you can hold it down on your side too. You don't have to hold it up. It's a good call, guys. We got a 25 second rest coming up. 30 I guess. Twenty-five seconds team. Remember, you can also increase the weights after this round. So whatever you're starting with, if it feels easy, you can increase it. We're going in 10 seconds. Left leg or whatever leg you didn't start on. I might try holding it on my side, see how that goes. One, and work. Slow, touch, drive. This is up. I actually like it down at my side. So I can isolate the leg a little more. I'm gonna go heavier though. I'm gonna go 40. See how that goes. All right, team. We got hip thrust coming up. I'm gonna bump our speed up a little, say 10 seconds here. I'm gonna go 65 on the hip thrust. Remember, this is a higher rep set. We're going for 15 reps here. Keep your chin tucked. Have your whole body pivot on the bench. If you don't have a bench, you can do this on the floor as well. Here, hold the dumbbell here, squeeze up. Same concept. It's just not as much range of motion. We're going in three, one, and work. 15, walk out here, pivot, 
pues fue ese. Team. Three, one, one minute rest, guys. All right, I'm staying with the 65 on that. That felt pretty good. Felt it in the glutes. Like I said, I'm going up to 40 on the step down, holding it at my side. Holding at the side takes a little stress off the low back and upper back and arms and shoulders. Feels kind of good, actually. Good call, Jorge. That's how you're doing that. Walk it off, guys. We're back to the right leg or whatever leg you started on. In 15 seconds. Slow descent. Let that foot just kiss the ground. Don't jump. And let's work. Nice and slow, touch, drop. No jump. It's a step down, not step up. Make it harder by going to the heel if you want more of a challenge without adding more weight. Get a deeper range of motion, essentially. We got five seconds and a 25 second rest. Fifteen seconds. Left leg or the opposite leg. Strapping up. Go. In five. Three. One. Let's work. We got 15 reps in 25 seconds. <clears throat> Walk it off. Think about pausing at the top and squeezing those glutes. I'm gonna start setting up. We're going. In 10. Five. 15, two, one, and work team. Slow, pause, squeeze, 15.
15. Good. Three, one. One more round, guys. Track your weights and reps. We got a drop set on the last set of the hip thrust. So I'm gonna go from a 65, I think I can go like 50s on this. Hit your 15 or your max reps, and then drop to a lighter weight. Put that over here. The step downs are straight up. You can take little breaks if you need to get to your eight. I'm gonna stick with 40 there. We're going in 20 seconds, guys. Ten. Three, two, one. And work. Seven seconds, guys. Got a 25 second rest. Hitting the left leg. Remember, this is eight rep training. This is a little bit more strength oriented, a little longer rest breaks are necessary. <clears throat> if you're not finding them necessary, you might not be able to hit lifting heavy enough. 10 seconds, team. We're going left leg. Three. One, and work. Slow touch, drop. Whoop. I'm coming to the heel, I'm coming to a dead stop with my toe lifted up, so I can't jump. I gotta push through the left leg. Eight reps. heavy you hit 15 here or to your first rest break whatever comes first so if you're starting to fail at 10 or 11 stop there and go to your drop set <clears throat> one and work come on right into it Wait. 
Keep working, don't worry about the timer, team. Squeeze it out. Fifteen. Woo. All right, guys. Rest. Once you're done, track your weight. We got a minute and a half. We're in our next circuit. I got fifteen with forty-five. I use 50? I'll use 50, I think. All right, guys, we got dumbbell Romanian deadlifts for eight reps, no drop sets, only mile max sets. And then we got single leg calf raises. So for the single leg calf raises, you want something that you can prop your toe up on. So I'm gonna grab a plate, you can use a boot. You can use a ledge, you can use the edge of your bench, whatever you have to get the toe up. So for dumbbell Romanian deadlifts, we're going two heavy dumbbells. We're gonna go knees very slightly bent. Push your hips back as far as you can, pushing your knees back as well, not bending too much of the knees, and then driving up. We're going eight reps there, heavy. Mile max, <clears throat> the second and third set. And then standing calf raises. I like to go one dumbbell and I'll hold on to something or the other. We're going for 15 reps here. So you're gonna come up, nice and slow down. 15 reps on the right leg, I believe. Let me just double check the rep range. Yep, and then 15 on the left. The last set is a drop set. Any questions, guys? Let's do it. I'm going, what am I gonna do on the deadlift? I'm gonna go with 70s on my deadlift. Three, one, let's work, guys. Eight reps. Grab my 70s out. Eight good reps. Nice and slow. Shoulders back and together. Arch the low back. Hips back. Pause at the bottom. Feel that stretch. Drive. Eight seconds, team. And we're going single leg calf raise. I'm gonna go with 45 here. I'm gonna go 50, actually. I did 45 last time, we did 15. So I'm gonna go to 50 today. Single dumbbell, right leg for 15. Three. Two, and work. Slow on the way down, squeeze. seconds to finish guys we're gonna go pretty quick turnaround here we're gonna only go 10 15 second rest we'll call it I'll make it a little faster we don't need a ton of rest to recover between calves 15 seconds team <clears throat> on a 10 left leg for 15 in five three two one let's work Grabbing, holding, big stretch, squeeze, slow on the way down.
Woo. All right, track your weights and rep. We got a 45 second rest. We're gonna go before we get into the second set. Coming up. Three, one, 45, team. Back to your deadlifts. Increase or decrease the weight if it felt too hard or too easy on that first set. I'm gonna stick with my 70s for one more. See how it feels. And I'll work from there. We're going in 10 seconds, team. Another set of eight. In five, three, two, one, work. Back in together, arch the low back. Feel that stretch, pause at the bottom. Drive back up. Nice. Glutes and hamstrings. Three, two, one. Calf raises, right leg for 15. Take a little breaks here if you need to. It's a mile max set. second rest coming up we're only gonna make it 15 though actually Let's go a little quicker here we're going in eight left leg five three two one let's go team come on big stretch at the bottom drive up squeeze all calf try to keep that knee locked out if you can seconds team all right final set of these two movements we got straight set or mile max set of the deadlifts and then we're gonna do a drop set on both calves so hit your 15 or whatever break you need to take first whatever 
and then immediately drop to a lighter weight. I'm gonna go from 50s to 35s. The calves can handle a little bit of volume, so I'm gonna take a little smaller drop there. We're going in 15 seconds. Last set of deadlifts. Focus on that deep stretch, pushing your hips and your knees back towards the wall behind you. Pause at the bottom and initiate with those hamstrings and glutes. Three, two, one, and work guys, come on. Last set. Let's do it. Shoulders back and together. I'm arching the low back to start. Head up. Three, one, 25 seconds, team. Calf raises, drop set. Let's do it. Like I said, I'm going 50 to 35. I'm gonna put my 35 right up here. So I got it. Three, right leg, and it worked. Come on, squeeze. <sighs> I got 11. I stopped getting a good contraction. And then I'm going to the 35. Seven. Eleven and seven. Woo! All right, I'm gonna try to match that on the other side. 25 second rest, team. Seven, got it. Woo, calves are burning. All right guys, last work, last movement of the workout. We got a little core. I know this is a long one guys, so I can always make up the core in another day, but we're gonna do it. 10 reps, decline sit-ups. We got 60 seconds each movement, 30 seconds of rest. <clears throat> I'm gonna go with a 40 pound dumbbell here. I'm gonna elevate my bench a little bit too with that plate. If you don't have a bench that goes on a decline, you can do this on the floor. Just hook your feet under something to give you some leverage. So you're gonna hold the dumbbell on your chest, upper chest. You're gonna go all the way down, fully extend the rib cage, and then sit up. 
10 reps. We're going in 20 seconds, team. Let me just check my weights on this. I feel like I've done. Yeah, I'm gonna go 40. That's the heaviest I've done. Let's see, for 10. We're going in eight. We'll have a 30 second turnaround here. We're three sets and we're out of here. Three, one, and work guys, come on. Nice and slow, full extension, let the head touch, squeeze. Too bad with the 40. Let's see how the second set feels. 30 seconds rest, team. Don't need these straps anymore. Oh. Track it. We're going in 12 seconds, team. I know I've mentioned this before, but the abs need to be trained like any other muscle. Progressive overload, more reps, more weights, more sets. That's how they get bigger, stronger, more defined. Let's work. Well, not more defined, but <clears throat> if you get leaner, <clears throat> they'll pop more. Feeling it. Two, one. Press. One more side, guys. And we are done. <laughs> Fifteen. This last set's gonna hurt. Eight. Do it. Three. Two, one, let's go. 10 reps. You can break it up if you need to. books. We'll be back tomorrow with our final upper body workout of the week. This cycle, three upper body workouts a week, two lower body workouts a week. It's going to be a fun one. Hope to see you guys there. We all know champions train on Fridays. I'll see you then. Have a good one, guys. Bye.